Marketing Makeover on ETV. I'm a copywriter, marketing strategist, and marketing coach, and I work with entrepreneurs like you to help you attract your ideal clients and grow the business of your dreams. And since the late 1990s, I've also had the privilege of working with national ad agency accounts to help them sell their products and services across the country as well. Today, I'm going to ask you a question. Are you selling a product or service that your clients are actually looking for? Are you creating products and, and services that nobody even knows exists? Because it's easier to sell a product or service when somebody's actively looking for it. I was speaking with my mother the other day. She's 88 and in the early stages of Alzheimer's and she's a great cook. She was asked to create a dessert for a fundraising um, banquet and uh, everybody said to her, can you please make that Mississippi mud? And she thought, oh, I just want to make an apple pie. But everybody was saying Mississippi mud. I'm not sure if you've ever had it before, but it's that layer of good shortcake bottom and chocolate and cream cheese and Dream Whip and just a, an amazing light dessert. She made it. She had lots of accolades, but she said to me later, she said, you know, I really wanted to make pie. I don't know why I had to make that dessert. And I said, but mom, that's what they were asking for. That's what they were looking for. You gave them what they wanted. And I said to her, it's just like in marketing. She wouldn't have understand that um, at all these days, but uh, it did, it was kind of getting the point across that she actually gave them what they were asking for, what they were actively looking for. They didn't want the apple pie. It doesn't matter that she could make that at another time. She could, you know, give that um, other option at different times, just like you can give different options. But what is it that your clients are actively looking for? It seems like sometimes, uh, People are looking to create something new and something different, something that nobody's ever heard of before. And that's difficult today because there's nothing new under the sun. It's how you're promoting it, how you're offering it, how you're differentiating yourself. If you've created a brand new product that nobody's heard of and nobody's looking for, you're not going to make any money it's going to be extremely difficult to sell. So start looking at what is it that your clients really want? How do you stand out from everybody else offering the same type of products or services? Then if you can hone in and have a clear message to get that um, a point across on why they should be buying from you, the value that you can give, then it's going to be so much easier to make the sale. So on your marketing makeover, I want to hear from you. I want to know what are your questions? What are the stumbling blocks that you're coming up with on a regular basis? Is it attracting clients, the type of clients that will actually pay for your products and services? Is it getting free publicity, getting the media to come to your events, getting showcased and having articles written about you in newspapers, magazines, being shown on television, on the radio, getting that word out about you in a way that really makes it authentic when it's about you and not written by you. Are you looking at creating an easing, writing articles, where to post them after, um, fine tuning on really who your ideal client is, what are your burning questions? And we can look at marketing offline and online, driving traffic to your website, increasing your, your uh, conversion rates, creating informational products, how to package them, how to price them, that's always a big one. How to start getting speaking engagements. Any of your marketing questions to grow your business, please send them to me. You can email me your questions to Susan at susanregear.com and in the subject line put ETV. So that's 
Susan at SusanRegier.com, S-U-S-A-N-R-E-G-I-E-R. I'm going to answer your questions on the future Your Marketing Makeover shows, and I want to help you to attract your clients so that you can fascinate, educate, and dominate your market. Thanks, and I look forward to seeing you on the next episode of Your Marketing Makeover.